we hear from a lot of people who see these briefings as sort of happy talk briefings. And no happy talk today. You and, and some of the officials paint a rosy picture of what is happening around the country. Uh, if you look at some of these questions, do we have enough masks? No. Do we have enough tests? No. Do we have enough PPE? No. Why would you say no? Do we have I enough think medical the answer equipment? Is yes. I think the answer is yes. What do you say to, I mean, you watch the coverage. You know what I'm I say? watching a lot of the coverage. Well, a lot of it's fake news. No, no, a lot of it's fake not, news. A lot of it's fake news. Let me just When the doctors the, and the medical the governors, come on our air the and governors say reported, we don't have enough tests, we don't have enough The governor, masks. yeah, depending on your air, they always say that, because otherwise you're not going to put them on. This is not happy talk. Maybe it's happy talk for you. It's not happy talk for me. We're talking about death. We're talking about the greatest economy in the world. One day I have to close it off. And we did the right thing, because maybe it would have been two million people died, instead of whatever that final number will be, which could be 60, could be 70, could be 75, could be 55. Thousands of people have died. There's nothing happy about it, Jim. This is sad talk. This is the saddest, these are the saddest, these are the saddest news conferences that I've ever had.